Hey everybody, how are you guys on this super rainy, cold, icy, disgusting Friday? <sighs> Not a fan, but I mean, I guess I'll take rain over snow. I do like snow. I understand that Christmas is in just a few days, but I'm like, it's not my thing. <laughs> I like a nice dusting, I'm like, oh, it's picture perfect. And then like go away. But you have to remember that like I'm way up Eastern Canada. So like four to six to like 10 feet of snow is normal and common. I'm not down with that. The holidays are coming up, you guys. That does not mean that you have to sacrifice yourself figurati figuratively or literally. For those of you that do not know me, my name is Brittany Budd. I'm a leader, a coach, and a mentor, and I empower women to build confidence and create success so they can live the lifestyle of their dreams. So you guys, you all know what I'm talking about, right? Everything's crazy right now. I'll tell you, my husband just went downstairs with armloads of boxes so that we can start wrapping presents. And it's it's tiring, right? You get exhausted, you get frustrated, you get stressed out. There's so much to do. I gotta pull my turkey out. People are driving like they've never been behind the wheel in their lives before. They're running red lights. They're parking like crazy people. The stores are absolute chaos. And you guys, you do not need to sacrifice yourself. Hear me when I say this. Give yourself permission to actually enjoy the holiday season. You don't need to sacrifice yourself. You don't need to be so worn out from the stress of it all that you're not enjoying anything. You know, I love my mom. Okay, I love my mom so much, but she was one of those people. And she still kind of is one of those people. Like growing up for us, Christmas was kind of stressful. My mom was like really high strung the whole time. And you know, it's been like a hundred years. She's still not great at figuring out the timing on making a turkey dinner every time. You know, we'd have people over as a kid, but even now, like, we go to their house, and I get sucked into helping, which I do not mind doing, but it's just, it's chaos, right? So, she doesn't need to do that. I want you guys to give yourself permission to enjoy the holidays with your family and your friends, and if you are someone that has negative situations in your lives, you guys, just because it's the holidays, that does not mean, like I said, you don't have to sacrifice yourself. And I'm talking literally and figuratively. You don't have to spend time with people that don't make you feel good. The holidays are meant for love, light, joy, laughter. And if you are spending them drained, sucked out, cranky and miserable and just dreading every minute of it, what good is that? That's not what it's all about. Give yourself permission to say no to people. You know, someone asks you to bring the cranberry sauce and you're not into it, tell them no. Don't say yes just to people please if it's going to make you have a negative time, if it's going to make you feel cranky, if it's going to bring your vibrations down, guys, just don't do it. It's okay. You know, my, without too many details, my sister-in-law and her mom are like butting heads right now. And my niece had her Christmas concert and her grandmother showed up and there was a big conflict there. That's not fun. You know, my niece is always going to remember that conflict. And my sister-in-law is like, well, she's my mom. Like, I kind of have to deal with that. No, you don't. Just because it's the holidays, you do not have to sacrifice yourself for other people. You do not have to sacrifice yourself for other people. Let me say it again. You do not have to sacrifice yourself for other people. I don't care if it's the holidays. I know it's Jesus' birthday. I know it's a time for family. But like I said, it's time for love, laughter, joy, peace. 
You need to be allowed to feel those things too. Say no when it doesn't suit you. And say yes when it does. Do the things that make you feel good. And don't let anybody guilt you if you say, I don't want to go there. I don't want to bring roles. I don't want to do that. I'm tired. You are allowed to take care of your mental health and well-being during the holidays. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Christmas, the holidays, you know, Hanukkah, whatever. I know there's a lot of holidays right now and I don't know all of them, but whatever you're celebrating, please take care of yourselves. Take care of your loved ones. Be with the people you want to be with. Don't get stressed out. You know, Christmas isn't like four nights, four sleeps. If you don't have your crap done, who cares? Nobody knows. Your kids are not going to know because you probably have all the big stuff. It doesn't matter if the stockings are stuffed. It doesn't matter if everything's wrapped. It doesn't matter if you forgot to take the turkey out and now you have to have Chinese food. It doesn't freaking matter. What matters is the people that you're with are going to remember that it was happy. They're not going to remember. Well, you don't want them to remember that it was stressful. You don't want them to be like, ugh, it's the holidays. You don't want to feel like that. Ugh, it's the holidays. I hate the freaking holidays. If that's you... Today's the day I encourage you to flip that around. I encourage you to let go of the low vibrations, open up to the high vibrations, and do the things that bring you joy. So I hope you guys enjoy that tonight. <laughs> Have an amazing rest of your Friday. As always, my stuff is public. Feel free to share this. Feel free to tag some friends. Whatever you want to do, go at her. All right, you guys, I hope you have an amazing day. I will be back here tomorrow, but then naturally I'm taking off Monday and Tuesday. I might come back on Boxing Day. It depends. Depends if I feel moved with a message. So now I'll come back on Boxing Day. All right, you guys, have a Merry Christmas. Actually, no, I'll do all this tomorrow. I'll do, all, I'll do my happy holidays tomorrow. You guys enjoy the rest of your Friday night. Stay warm. Enjoy the people you're with. Give everybody a big hug. And most importantly, tell the people you love that you love them. Have a good night.